All right, guys, really quickly, this is going to be like the intro to the video, like an intro to an intro. I just wanted to talk about some things here on Mind Lucky. We have already made a pretty big content update and an update that is going to help a bunch of new, like, free to play players. So, if you guys do want to join the Mind Lucky Discord, it's linked down below in the description. You guys can check out the full change log. But, anyways, guys, I think even in today's video, I said I wanted to make pets a little bit more obtainable to free to play players. So that way, you know, they could get started, start ranking up easier, start leveling up a little bit faster. And that is exactly what we have done with with this update. Treasure keys are now going to be even more common while fishing, so you guys can unlock more treasure chests as you fish. And from those treasure chests, we have buffed the rate of temporary pet eggs, so they're going to be more common in your treasure boxes and in your lucky wheel spins. Basically, it just means that you guys can get more pets. We've also buffed the rates of getting like charm boxes, common bosses, and black market crates from the treasure chests as well. Basically, buffed the rates of all of the actual good rewards. They have also dropped brand new pets, bro. Two new pets. They are juniors so basically there's a brand new snowman pet and it's basically a junior version of the ice golem but they're going to be made more common so free to play players can hop on and get the very easily obtained pets and still compete still progress and have fun and then there's a brand new sparkler pet which is just a junior version of the bomber pet so guys we have already made massive massive changes here on the server i suggested some of these changes and again if you guys want to make any suggestions literally the staff team here on mind lucky listen to everything you guys suggest you guys can make a ticket in discord to suggest some features or something you want added any bugs or anything that you find you literally just like tell a staff member that's online and they will fix it asap so i've already said this but mind lucky has a great great team over here and like i said bro i am a media owner so i am trying to build with these guys and i think we've already made the server better after being here for a couple of days so hopefully you guys do come check it out it is also the one year anniversary of mind lucky as well so there is a brand new anniversary v kit and a brand new anniversary tag if you guys do want to you know spend some money on the bycraft store you guys can look at getting some of those if you want but yeah i just wanted to go ahead and get all of that information out because this video is like slightly pre-recorded like i recorded this video yesterday and the update dropped earlier today so the update wasn't actually out in this video but anyways hopefully you guys come hop on give the server a chance again if you don't like it suggest some things that we could do to make it better because we are looking to try to improve and trust we have plenty of content updates still coming but anyways yeah with all that being said go ahead and enjoy today's let's play video Yo guys, what is going on? It is Royal here today, back for episode two of the brand new prison series here on royal.mindlucky.net. Of course, if you guys aren't already aware, this is my brand new prison server. It is just a small server right now. You know, we're just starting out trying to grow it. But if you guys would like to hop on, using my custom IP does directly support me, so I would greatly appreciate it. And if you guys missed the last episode, there was a little secret giveaway in that video as well. But a lot of people missed that giveaway, okay? But I have just barely uploaded the first video i've already seen a bunch of new players hop on checking out the server so i do greatly appreciate every single one of you hopping on to check it out you know sometimes uh some new players they hop in the chat and say some pretty weird things but uh i mean we're just gonna ignore that anyways guys we are back for episode two i am still slightly sick because again i just barely uploaded the first video but starting to feel a little bit better thankfully so in today's video guys there are a couple of things that i want to do and get like accomplished first things first is i want to get the best charged enchant on the entire server now if you guys haven't played mind lucky before and you don't know what the charged enchants actually are it's basically just like prestiging an enchant so every enchant that you see blink orange with orange glass panes you can actually charge so currently we can only get mind bomb royal rumble and jackhammer now jackhammer charged would be godlike but the thing is the requirement is rank 1000 i am rank 500 so nowhere near getting the charged version of jackhammer but we did max out the charge token collector in the last episode so that is dope to see and then how much is it to charge like mind bomb bro this can't be yeah this is actually nothing we are finally starting to make like an okay-ish amount of tokens the 720 trillion tokens i have in my balance right now i've actually got from just purely mining so it might not sound like a ton but if i do like slash robots we are out mining our robots over here we'll collect this put us at one quadrillion tokens for today's intro because we are going to dump all of these tokens into the best charged enchant and that is going to be royal rumble okay now if we just read the description of this it says turn a row of your mind into incredibly valuable blocks basically the regular royal rumble will turn an entire layer to 100 percent ruby blocks now with charged ruby rumble you still get ruby blocks but you also get a bunch of emerald blocks like this one right here and emerald blocks are scattered throughout the entire mine but they are very very rare but they are the most valuable block on the entire server at least i believe so let's go ahead and grab this right now royal rumble i don't know if we're gonna have 
enough to max this thing out, but rank requirement is only 500. We are rank 550 almost, so boom, charge this up, and oh my god, we cannot max this thing out. We got a little over halfway maxed, but that's it. So it's not great, but I mean, we only got like a couple more levels to go, bro. It shouldn't be too bad, especially if we keep mining, keep grinding. Now let's see if we can actually get this to proc on camera, and I believe since we're pickaxe rank 560 as well, we should have unlocked the zookeeper enchant, which is a massive, massive enchant, especially whenever you have a hot bar of pets like I do right here. Now, granted, these aren't the best pets in the entire world, okay, guys? We literally didn't get one ice golem pet throughout our entire opening in the first episode, so honestly, the pets are rather mid, but it's not like we're a super trash player on the server. In the next coming days, I'm really gonna try and, you know, keep upgrading my pickaxe and stuff to make more currencies, but I think we'll be able to snipe some, like, ice golem pets or some more bomber pets and try and grab those for, like, tokens, gems, or rubies. But look, this guy right here just messaged me, like I said. I did a secret giveaway in the last episode. Is the code still up for grabs from the video? It is not because I just told him all of the codes have already been claimed, but we're gonna do another one right now in this video. So, if you guys are watching this right now, hop onto the server with royal.mindlucky.net. As soon as you see this, and I will be online whenever this video goes up, do slash message royal k9 and message me hashtag bomber because we are going to be giving away three free bomber pets to three players who hop on and message me this. Obviously, first come, first serve. So, the first three players that hop on and message me this are going to be winning the bomber pets. And you guys should know already how important pets are here on Mind Lucky, dude. They are an absolute necessity. I still want to work with the server and suggest some other updates that they could drop to try and help free to play players get some actual decent pets still. And I feel like I do have a couple ideas. But, anyways, let's go ahead, go to the gem enchants, and I can already see it. We have unlocked Zookeeper right here. And we are going to dump literally 338 million gems straight into Zookeeper, dude. This enchant is absolutely godlike. Let's just read the description. Activate all pets in your hotbar for a short duration. So as you guys can see, we have a full hotbar of pets. All of these are going to activate whenever Zookeeper activates. So that's what I was saving all of my gems for. I'm saving all of my rubies currently for an OP set, but that costs like 200,000 rubies. So we're nowhere near that at the moment. And wait a minute, bro. Have I not gotten a charged ruby rumble proc yet? Don't tell me I got to max the enchant out first before it will like even proc once because that would be tragic. But another thing I want to check out in today's video is dungeons. I literally have no clue what dungeons look like or what dungeons even entail, but that is a brand new content update this map. If we don't check it out in today's video, we're definitely checking it out in the next episode. So plenty of things to do. And actually, now that I'm mining, another thing that we can do right now is open up a bunch of our keys because I've been mining a decent amount off camera. And if I do slash crates, we should have, yeah, we have over 30 thousand keys so let's open all and this should give us a bunch of drills and a bunch of bombs as well that are just going to give us literally instantaneous ranks and just help us level up right now we're all we still have fifteen thousand open i guess we're opening up a bunch of token keys now we're on the gems i don't know if our inventory is going to get full and oh it's going to get full bro wait boom you do not have any keys available oh my god it literally almost got completely filled but look at how many drills we have just earned and how many bombs there was a brand new update with bombs this season where you can now just like spam i guess you can't spam too fast there's a, like a 0.3 second cooldown on them but before you could only have like five bombs in your mind going at once so now you can just kind of spam these and they're a lot more useful because i went through a entire stack in a couple of seconds and these bombs are like i think these are just the common bombs right q bombs i don't think are that great let's move on to the rares Oh, the rares are way better, dude. And this just absolutely eats through your mind. Now, I do believe we should probably get down every single drill that we just ended up winning. I don't know what the limit on drills is in your mind. Okay, six is the limit. But we should definitely run through all of these and see how many ranks we end up getting. And wait a minute, just right there, bro. This is another update that I forgot to show in the first episode. But slash battle pass is a thing. As you guys can see, we just completed a mission from our pass. So slash battle pass, if we take a look at this, whenever you guys do challenge, Challenges on here. I believe these are like daily challenges that reroll every single day. We've already completed this one and I'm seeing some parkour challenges, which is looking absolutely free besides this one. Getting 20 points on the hard parkour is brutal, but these are the weekly missions right here. We've already completed six uh, out of 10 of these. This one, bro, PVP. PVP is still something I never checked out on the server, but we're 100% going to try to PVP at least this season. Mine 500k Roblox. That's still going to take a fat minute. We just completed the freeloader task scroll master open 200 scrolls now you'll really start to get like snowballed scrolls i think whenever your mind like gets bigger and then this one right here wait achieve 100 points on easy parkour we can easily do that but if you guys don't know 
there is a Battle Pass Star Shop where you can purchase some really good items, temporary OP pet egg, or you can get permanents for 8,000, 6,000 for the permanent rare eggs, 5,000 for the permanent generics. You can even get black market crates, two of them for 8.5K. The metal scraps, um, that's probably not worth it. I wouldn't buy this reward with your battle stars, but right here, we're trying to save up 8,000. I'm at 6.3K right now. So we're gonna try and get to 8,000 battle stars and purchase ourselves a free OP pet egg and pray to God, we get an ice golem. And there we go. Just like that, we used all of our stuff. I've been like typing in chat, so I got a little distracted, but we only got to rank 589. Honestly, a little underwhelming from like 30,000 keys. But at some point, I did know that, you know, they started to slow down and they weren't gonna like upgrade you as much. But hold on, guys. I put in chat that I didn't get not one ice golem pet and then Exo Blade said, do you want one? I don't know if he was trolling, but you know, if he's, uh, you know, not using a snow golem pet, I will definitely accept that. Raging Sushi typed in the chat, do you want the smoke royal? And I said, I'd prefer a snow golem pet, but apparently you can't trade, uh, pets that are on cooldown. So we actually have to wait two minutes. I don't know if it's a temporary pet or if it's a permanent pet, but guys, we are taking the snow golem. Okay. So really quickly, let's hop into the parkour real quick and let me complete the battle pass challenges. So that way we can go ahead and get some extra points. And what that bro, I have to disable clouds because this is insanity. And and here in a second, we should be getting to 100 jumps, which I believe is like the max amount in the past. I don't think you get rewards for anything past 100, unfortunately. So boom, there we go. We hit 100. I might just jump off because I don't really want to uh, keep that guy waiting with the snow golem pet because it's a free snow golem. So yeah, let's just go ahead and hop off. And is he here? Ah, he's right here. Boom. There is the snow golem pet. Bro, if he doesn't need this, I'm grabbing W. Shout out to Exo Blades. And wait, is this a permanent one? Oh my God, bro. I think this is, I can't tell. What do their like temp ones look like? Listen, I don't know, but let's go ahead and go to slash mine. I think this is literally a permanent pet. Now every map they do place these snow golems throughout like your mine build. And then they like chuck it. I see him. The snow golem is all the way over here. So he's going to chuck. Oh, you already chucked one. I completely missed it. But anyways, guys, now I think we're going to go on a bit of a grinding spree. Wait, I still have 800 trillion tokens. I am smoking. Hold on. Oh, we just... Just unlocked coupon ledger as well which is a brand new enchant but maybe we should get quest seeker have a chance of finding legendary scrolls those are huge there's just so many things i need to upgrade because dude i still need to max this out actually all right we're gonna go ahead try and max out charged royal rumble and we just have so many enchants we have still got to purchase so i'm gonna go on a bit of a grinding spree and yeah i'll see you guys in one second all right guys we have been grinding for a decent amount of time i am currently ranked 890 we're almost at 500,000 roblox which is another past challenge and guys we are so close to having 8,000 battle stars, all right? We're only 300 off. And I think the battle pass daily challenges just reset. So if we take a look, I think we're about to complete one. Whenever we complete this right here, we gotta get a decent amount more gems, but like the rubies are gonna be done any minute. But once we complete this challenge right here, we will be able to cop that. And actually we can also go do, you know, parkour once again. But the reason why I started recording this clip is because we are going to make our first recruit to the gang for the entire season. Now I do actually think I'm gonna be recruiting guys so if you do want to join hop on the server you guys obviously you know you got to start grinding if you guys are like rank 100 you're not gonna get into the gang i'm not gonna lie to you so if you guys do want to join you know just make sure you guys are grinding and uh yeah we'll have spots opening up the next couple of days but for right now i'm actually going to leave my gang and we are going to join exoblades the same dude who gave us the ice golem pet but we're actually going to join his gang and he's going to make me leader the reason we're joining his is because he probably has more raw blocks than me because if we take a look at the leaderboard Exoblades is literally the highest ranked player on the entire server. And you know, not to gas myself, but look at your boy. We are the eighth highest rank on the server as well. And yeah, wow. This guy literally has the number one most Roblox on the server. So kind of a no brainer. I'm going to go join his gang. All right. So gang leave, I think. Is that how you do it? You cannot just leave as the owner. Please use gang, gang disband. Is that a thing? Oh, boom. Disband, bro. Get me out of there. Message Exoblades. And guys, I think I'm finally getting over the sickness because it is now late at night, bro. And I still feel uh, phenomenal. Not drained. You know, I have energy still. Boom. We have been invited. So gang join Exo, Exo, boom. We 
are in. Now, if I do slash gang and we look at gang enchants, you guys can see these gang enchants or gang upgrades take a lot of raw blocks. So he has gotten to 800k raw blocks by himself, and this is going to unlock an extra gang member once we hit a million. And then the next one is going to be a rank XP multiplier at 3 million blocks, which is going to be huge. The next one, multiply the amount of blocks your gang receives for block top that scales with members online. And then the final one at 8 million raw blocks, which is going to take forever to end up hitting multiply the amount of tokens received for each gang member and we have just been made the leader and it does come you know with its own little gang chat right there so if you guys are going to be grinding this season of mind lucky you guys can definitely dm me if you guys are a high ranker if you just have like a lot of raw blocks i will definitely slide you an invite until you know we we run out of space but also guys we are now finally making a really good amount of tokens like we have one quadrillion just chilling in our balance right now i've been spam upgrading tokens bonanza i'm not sure if that's the best because we did end up maxing charged ruby rumble or royal rumble i don't know why i call it ruby rumble but i meant royal rumble okay this is the best charged enchant whenever you need like tokens at least i think because whenever you get that charged layer and the jackhammer procs on it you make a fat amount of tokens so if you guys feel like you're struggling to make some tokens definitely shoot for that enchant but for right now i mean we still have one quadrillion that i don't really know what to spend it on and wait we just unlocked the enchant black hole we can only get seven levels of this for 900 trillion which is kind of ridiculous but i do also feel like essence has been helping us out a lot obviously essence is one of the best enchants on the entire server it's just super expensive so i don't know i might just keep spam upgrading tokens bonanza or what if i save all of my tokens for whenever we hit rank 1000 and then we charge this jackhammer enchant finally and then just spend all of the tokens on that that might be the move because right now i don't see anything else that's like super super worth i'll get a couple levels of black hole but definitely don't want to spend too much on that but we have it at level three so it does have some sort of chance to proc because tokens bonanza is also getting pretty expensive but yeah with that charge enchant we are finally starting to make some real tokens which is great to see i do also have three unlocked treasures right here let's go ahead and open these three i still haven't gotten one. Oh my god there it is a temporary op pet egg finally out of a treasure chest now we just probably want to see combination pets because we're getting very close to like the maxed out rank so that's whenever you want to make the switch over to the combination pets but right there a currency box absolutely a terrible reward and boom 150 mining keys pretty buns as well i do have 14 uh, or locked treasure chests but i believe you get the keys from fishing and i don't really want to check out fishing just yet and wait bro if we claim our robots i'm curious if we'll complete our little battle pass thing boom does that count towards it if we look at our battle pass no no, it does not. And Jesus Christ, guys, we literally just hit 5,000 raw blocks before we got the, like, 2.5 million gems, bro. I didn't have gems bonanza maxed out, so I did max that out off camera really quickly, but still. Slash battle pass, we should now officially have enough to buy ourselves a permanent OP pet egg, and we are praying for combination pets now. So let's go ahead, boom, unlock all of those scrolls as well. We are now at 2.3 quadrillion tokens. And for the temporary pet egg first, bro, boom, place this thing down. What are we gonna get? This is the one that we got from the treasure chest. And then the other one is gonna be the free one that we got from battle pass and ooh, a scrap dog Ugh, that is uh that is kind of gross not good in the slightest hopefully we saved our good luck for the actual permanent op pet egg right here bang drop this bad boy down bro please be a combination bro or at least an ice golem nothing in between and combination pet absolutely huge and wait a minute bro hold on we just got a possible prospect to uh invite elsa jean um wants to be invited i want to ask exo first and they said i mean if you want to i mean i think elsa jean is a very good player he doesn't care but elsa jean i've been fighting this guy for his rank top spot literally all day so i think he could be a pretty decent recruit so let's go ahead gang invite elsa jean right there bang wait oh existing gang and boom there we go he left his gang and now he's in ours we are a three man gang so far and i think we have three very solid players so anyways guys so far i am super super happy with the progress we have made in today's video we got ourselves an extra combination pet we're almost about to be rank 1000 we are on the rank top leaderboards and if we just look at bow top we have the fifth most rubies on the entire server second most gems at the moment and then yeah i mean coins were the seventh still not terrible at all so anyways guys listen i want to head over here 
to warp fishing just for the one time bro i have never fished on here in my entire life now i know you get shards and stuff from fishing boom we caught a fish right there that was good catch 5.2 billion tokens Okay, so that actually does get you tokens. Okay, hold on. Fishing is looking pretty easy, but I want to see how hard it is to catch like keys and stuff to unlock our locked treasures. And wait, whoa, what was that? A sack of shards right there. How many shards did we just get? 484, I'm assuming, because I've never fished before. And taking a look at these enchants, we do have to level up fishing quite a bit. Bigger bait, catch better fish more often i'll uh, receive more xp while fishing magnetize hook double the amount of metal scraps you find while fishing and then fish bomb click q to explode the waters i'm surprised there's actually not like a treasure chest key finder like enchant type thing i definitely feel like there should be so maybe that's an update i will suggest to the admins because we are media owner but yeah i already have a ton of suggestions to give to the staff team on stuff i think we could personally do better but yo is it just me or is fishing dumb easy we just got some fishing keys is that a treasure key or is that literally like a slash crates type of key oh it's a slash crates type of key that is brutal and wait we just got a treasure chest key right there that's actually not bad in 50 catches so let's see how long it actually takes to get another uh key if we can do it in 100 catches that would be great and if we take a look now we do have this but it says you must find the fishing logbook component and build the, the talisman bro i don't know what that means at all well we fish up you know another like 200 fish or something bro and we have not got another key so definitely some more updates to come with fishing as well but listen guys that is gonna do it for this episode of prisons next video we are going to be hitting rank 1000 checking out the dungeons and doing a ton more upgrading in that video as well so anyways guys hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did make sure you guys drop a like sub if you guys are new obviously come check out the server with royal.mindlucky.net and yeah i'll catch you guys in the next episode of the prisons series